Hi friends, welcome back to Angular Hero to Superhero series. If you are a beginner trying to learn Angular, there is another series, Angular Zero to Hero, in which I have explained all the basic concepts. You can find the link in the description. In this Angular series, Hero to Superhero, I am focusing on advanced concepts. In this video, I am going to show you how we can create a simple carousel. A carousel implementation is very easy. There are many third-party libraries available. Let's implement Bootstrap Carousel. Let's start. I have created a simple Angular application. As a first step, let us install ng-bootstrap. For that, let me go to the official website and copy this command. Let me invoke this command. Ok, bootstrap is installed. If I go to components and then carousel, we can see many examples. If we go to the stack blitz, we can see they are using standalone component. But let's try to implement this in our application where we are not using standalone component. We can see they have imported this carousel module here. In our case, we need to import this in our app module. Let's do that. Ok, let me go to the app component TS and let me create an images array in which let me have the names and captions of three images. You can see that I have already copied three images with these names in the assets folder. Ok, let me open the app component HTML and have a ngb carousel element. Inside that, let me use ng template and in that I am using ng for. Let image of images. Inside that ng template, let me create a div with some class name. And then inside that div, let me create an image element. Source is going to assets slash image name. And all text can be the caption. And let me create another div to show the caption. Ok, if we preview now, we will not see anything. We will not see any error also. We have to use the ngb slide directive, only then Angular identifies this as a carousel. Now we can see the carousel is working. But the style is not good. Let's apply some style. For the carousel wrapper class, let me give width 100vw, height 100vh and overflow hidden. Now this looks good. I have taken the images with good aspect ratio. Otherwise, I have to apply some styles to fit the images correctly. Ok, right now our caption is going below the viewport and so it is not visible. Let's position that correctly. For that, let me add position relative to the carousel wrapper class and then for the caption class, let me give position absolute, left 50 pixel, bottom 50 pixel, font size 40 pixel and font weight bold. And so we can see this. Now it looks good. Our carousel indicators are not clearly visible. Let's change the color. For that, we need to inspect and find the correct selector. And we have to add this CSS in the styles.css. Only then it will reflect. Ok, good. And right now the images are getting changed after every 5 seconds. Also, if I move my mouse over, the carousel animation is passed. But we can change this behavior. We can go to the API section in the official website. We can make use of any of these configurations if needed. First, let me change the interval. We can see the default value is 5 seconds. Let me change that to 2 seconds. For that, let me add the interval property here. And let me add the value as 2000. It is in milliseconds. Now we can see the animation is fast. I guess 3 seconds will be good. Ok, good. And if I mouse over, the animation is getting passed. That is because in the API, we can see there is a property called pass on hover and it is true by default. So if we don't need this behavior, we can change that to false. Now we can see if we move our mouse, animation is not getting passed. If we need to hide these arrows, we can set the show navigation arrows property to false, which is true by default.
Similarly, we can hide this also using this property. I request you to explore the other options in the API. This is how we can create a carousel component in our application. That's all for today. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel and support me. I'll be back with another concept soon. Thank you. Bye.